Hi, good evening everyone. Um, we are the Renegades. Um, today there's supposed to be five of us, but uh, unfortunately one's unable to make it. So there's me, Damien, today. There's Ain, Nor Ain, uh, Rosila Wati, and there's Masuri. So I'll start off with the, my hobbies. I'm into outdoor sports, rugby, um, jungle trekking, and a bit of sea, uh, sea activities. Um, when I used to, we used to sail a lot. I mean, sail as a team, as, as a group. And also, um, the trekking that we normally do is towards more interesting areas, not the commercial areas, but more the interesting areas, areas which, or places which have not been, um, local areas, which have not been, um, which is not too commercialized. Yeah. So, um, at this current situation with the MCO and whatnot, there's nothing much we can do. So, whenever I do have the time to even, oh yeah, I even cycle a bit. I mean, we do have the time to, uh, or rather, me and my friends have the time to uh, catch up with our hobbies. We make the best out of it. Okay, so now I'm going to pass you over to Masuri. Hi everyone, I am M. Sorry, I love M. A. H. L. U. R. I. Masuri. Hi, hi, Masuri. Hi. Hi, Masuri. So I love flowers actually, but this is artificial flowers. This is the soap uh, roses, and of course I I have a plenty of real plants, and also I have artificial plants. So this is plastic, yeah. This is monstera leaves, and it is artificial plant. But I love most is. Real plant. This is Monstera, baby Monstera. So ever since this uh, pandemic, and I'm working from home, so I become part-time gardener. So morning I will water my plant, evening I will plant, I will water the plant. So it is a therapy for me. And uh, in the kitchen also, I put some green, you know, to to make it fresh. Okay, behind me, as you can see, I purposely arranged just for these uh, hobbies uh, sharing. And last but not least, I have this little tiny snake plant. I think that's about it. My hobby, so I pass to Rosina. Hi, Rosina. Hi, everyone. Hi. So, Hi. So, Okay, hi. Okay, my hobby is reading. I read whenever I have free time. I have many uh, kinds of books that I read, have read, such as this book, Turkey, about Turkey, Kamar Artartuk. And then this one is about uh, Jeja Rasul from Caesar to Sanlir Ufa by Fetri. And then this is about a very, oh. I mean, professional. The hallmark of leadership. Oh. Okay, so reading has a lot of advantages. So in terms of it's a cheap way of getting information and also entertainment. So does it's also is a, I mean mind free to for me to keep me at a rest uh, during um, Saturday and Sunday. Okay, so let me let now I invite mine to proceed her hobby. Hey, I'm Ryan. As you can see behind me, you, I think you can guess. I love traveling. Yeah. I love traveling because it gives me the excitement when you go to new places. Even yeah. the air is different. You know, it's fresher. You can see I'm on extreme sports. I went skydiving. I jumped out of the plane at 12,000 feet actually. Oh. So I made a, a small uh, collage. These are the some of the countries that I've visited. Um, it started with me studying in Australia. Uh, so I was in Melbourne, I went to Sydney and Canberra and all that. But in 2009, I actually brought my children over uh, with me. So that's another me. But uh, for in year 2000, I went to some part of Europe. Uh, we went to Amsterdam. Uh, in Amsterdam, Model Road is, is, is a must, you know. It's a miniature village. And then we went to London, uh, Cologne, Germany, um, Paris, Glasgow in Scotland. Uh, we actually went to Glasgow. Um, Edinburgh, Dundee, visited St. Andrews and from Aberdeen, we flew back to London. So this is the, uh, oh yes, the Euro Disneyland. Never forget that if you go there. Yeah. So another one that I would like to share is my, in Australia. 
that I brought my children there. So we went to Sydney. We actually went to um, Gold Coast and then drove all the way down, all the way via uh, Wollongong, Sydney, Canberra, crossed the Great Divide Range, Grey Snow, and then went to Melbourne. So this one, when I went to New Zealand, so that is when I went skydiving. Okay. Nice. Um, this is in Rotorua. We went to Auckland. And this is Lake Pukapo. I tell you, it's a very beautiful lake. And this is in Water's Peak, yeah. where you can feed the, the, the animals. And in Melbourne. How, how so, high was your... How, how high was 12, your... 12,000 feet. 12,000 feet. Wow. Yeah. You know, going up on the plane, it takes us about 30 minutes to go, go up to that level. But it's, only, uh, it's only five minutes to get to the ground. Ten, yeah. Because we're going at 300 kilometers per hour. Yeah. Everything uh, moved. Oh. It was wonderful. It was exhilarating. Hello, everyone. Atarika here. Uh, I'm here to speak about my hobby, and my favorite hobby is reading. This is the latest book I'm reading, The Diamond Cutter. I love books on management, on management theories, on psychology, and especially on human behavior. So this is these are some of the books by my bedside, as you can see. And this is another one. And this is a classic, because I love this book as well. And uh, I have been reading from a child. I always have it to my father. Reading has brought me such immense pleasure. Any kind of reading, I feel like an armchair traveler. As I read, I travel through. And what is amazing about reading is as we read, we all read the same book, but we all get the essence different. It's as if it's written for us because we are seeing what we're looking for and we are understanding it from our map of the world, how we understand. From a child, reading made me relaxed. Reading made me happy. And I've enjoyed reading so much. That's our, that is from our group. Inshallah, we hope to have touch with us for the final thing. Thank okay. you. Thank you. See you guys. Bye. 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 Bye.